116 people were arrested for flouting COVID-19 regulations as nationwide crackdown on those defying health and safety protocols intensifies. Citizen TV filmed exclusive pictures at Seb's nightclub and entertainment joint where hundreds of revelers had locked themselves up past midnight. Some of the revelers escaped through the windows while some opted to battle the police. Saturday, 11.30 p.m., officers from the Nakuru Police Station, led by the Sub-County Police Commander, Nakuru East, the OCS, the Chief Bondeni Location, and a team from the Administration Police conducted an operation within Nakuru CBD. Targeting those selling alcohol and contravening the curfew regulations. At Seb's club, there was no regard for the curfew or the public health guidelines at a time when it was supposed to have been closed one and a half hours previously. For the revelers here, the night was just beginning. No safety protocols were observed, no social distancing. More than 500 revelers inside with the doors locked from outside. And when the police pounced at 12.30 a.m., hell broke loose. Chaos as revelers in panic tried to find every escape route, some jumping from the first floor of the building. They began throwing beer bottles at the police, and our cameraman on location, Ivan Sasiba, police had to use tear gas canisters to contain the revelers who outnumbered them. <laughs> However, many of them managed to escape through the windows, the police only managing to arrest 86, who were booked and will be charged in court on Monday. The nightclub's license is likely to be revoked. Wale tumeshika leo eh, kutokana na msako ya leo ni kutoka miaka 22 paka 35 na tunaonya vijana watii sheria ambaye zimepitishwa na serikali kwa sababu covid-19 it is real na iko hapa na kuru <tos> And in Nyali, Mombasa, a raid on Shisha joints, an operation led by the Mombasa governor Ali Hassan Joho and the police inspectorate netted 30 people. Those arrested were detained at the Nyali police station. This incident came a day after the inspector general of police, Hilary Mutiambai, announced that 840 people were arrested and 97 bars closed and 55 vehicles impounded during the nationwide crackdown. The operations, police say, will continue. Dorcas Wangira Citizen TV, Nairobi.